Oh, hi, I'm Alex. Uh, a year ago, my friend Jonathan and I started working on a new type of computer kit. Uh, we call it Cano, and we're really excited to show you it today. It, we designed it for all ages, all over the world, and it gets you coding right away. Hi, Jonathan. Hi. As kids, we loved playing games and building things with Lego. But today, the tools are different. Today, we have cheap computers. We have free software. And we started Cano in order to make these tools accessible for everyone, for fun and purpose. Now, the challenge for Cano was set by Mika, Alex's seven-year-old cousin. I want you to make this as simple and fun as Lego. Mika had a point, and it's not just seven-year-olds. I think a lot of us, you know, we're amazed. What an amazing time to be alive. We're fascinated by this, but we, we have no way to get in. The available resources they're tough. There isn't a simple, fun way to get started. We wanted to do something different, so we went around the world, we talked to hundreds of kids, parents, teachers, educators, artists, and we came up with Cano. It's based on three principles. Simple steps, storytelling, physical computing, and tying them all together, a sense of play and exploration. You plug in the pieces, you build a computer, your own computer. You build a case, you customize it with your own designs, you build an amazing DIY speaker, you code games like Snake and Pong, you dive into the command line and explore, you get to know your computer, you hack up games like Minecraft, and at the end of it all, you look back and you realize, wow, you've actually learned something. You've got a new type of skill, a new way of expressing yourself, and one that's gonna be very, very useful, we think, in the future. As computers have gotten more complicated, they've grown harder to understand. But it's more important than ever to give kids a way in or they won't be ready for the future. And it's wonderful to see the kids making and changing Pong with the Kano. With the Kano computer, it gives the power to create back to the people. It gives people the tools to create. It gives people the mindset to think that, okay, this was once closed, but now it's open. We made a computer. We made the coolest computer. It felt like you were actually the person who made it. So like, you. You weren't just playing it, you felt like you actually made it. So as you can see, we got great feedback. And now we're coming to Kickstarter because we want to make a bigger production and we want you to help us shape it and make it happen. We spent the last few months working with the right suppliers, preparing our production schedule, and most importantly, building a team of people from six different countries that are gonna help us make it happen and bring Cano to you. We've designed new plug-and-play hardware for this amazing, simple, out-of-the-box experience. It's so much fun, and we think you're gonna love it. On top of that, we've powered up the Pi with these great software games, levels, projects, and also fixes, an, an interface that's more intuitive and more familiar. We want to make more kits, of course, but we also want to push these updates back into the open source community. We think that together, all of us, we have the chance to do something really cool. We can give a new generation the ability to create with technology rather than just consume it. And that's something that we think is really worthwhile.